Right, so so left knee is going to double and bend, right knee is going to maybe lose a couple degrees. Yeah, you'll see it like this. Okay. Yeah. Then you're just going to do the opposite in the downswing. So I've already got some, I've already got some momentum going back toward the target from my recentering. Yep, yep. I'm just going to ride that momentum and let my knees switch. So now this is vertical, this is straight, and this is where people get off track. They were so worried about early extension that they're trying to keep, and this is where Mike's thought comes in, keeping the hips in this awkward position. When you let your knees switch, you've got to let the right side of your rear end come off the wall so that your right leg can kind of get into this hitting area, and that would keep the left side of my rear end back. It's literally kind of almost a mirror of the backswing. So instead of this bend, right, this hip flexion, and like that coming into play, you're getting it something like this where this thigh is now more vertical coming into the ball, right? Just like it is on the backswing. 